Hi, hello, welcome for the Tamil Kudiyosa channel viewers and we are going to interview today a uh, most important person in India and uh, the name is called Mr. Haider Ali Syed and he is from Mumbai, from Bandra and he is a researcher and social activist of a race and caste and we are going to interview today and uh, hi sir, welcome. Thank you. Welcome. Right from teenage, I was attracted to religion and uh, mosque and spiritualism and then uh, like a, it's like a journey, it's like from a teenage I saw a journey, slowly, slowly I gradually developed a, like into research and all, oh, uh, research okay. and all and then uh, usually, usually people used to, uh, the Jamaat used to come and uh, tell us to come to Jamaat and all but I always stick to Quran, I said if you are teaching me Quran then only I will be able to join you. Okay, that's your part of your research, yeah. you are into researcher. I am into researcher. Okay, when you get started your research? After 10th, then, then uh, gradually like I went to different different uh, school of thought of Islam mm. and then uh, ultimately got a chance to work with Dr. Zakir Naik. So after 10th, you started your research? After 10th, like gradually then entered, entered into business, by uh, that business and part time I was into research and all. And gradually like and uh, after my marriage, I went into full time in, uh, with Zakir Naik uh, for 8th month I was uh, there. During the time when uh, in Orissa, the RSS people burn uh, some pastor, no? that time I was working with Dr. Zakir. And which things impress you that to start a research in particularly for race and custom? See, Quran talks about equality. Okay. And uh, at the same time, there is a Hanfi fiqh which talks about Ansari as suppressed, like how Manu law is talking about. Same yes. thing, Hanfi law is also talking about. Okay. So you're talking about Manu laws and Hanfi law? Hanfi law is a similar track. So it's totally like contradiction. What Quran talks about and what Hanfi law and Manu are on a similar track. Okay. How, how, how you can talk about uh, both are similar because this is completely See, uh, in a uh, Manu law, Shudra are considered inferior. In Hanfi law, Ansaris are considered as inferior. There are lower caste in Muslim also, no? Upper caste, lower caste in oh. Muslim also. Yes, I agree that. I agree yeah. that because. So in Muslim also there is a caste system. They are maintaining the caste system. The casteism is yeah. been yeah, it's maintained. It's maintained. Okay. So because the research and which point you've been we we have to research it because you're talking about Manu, also you're talking about for uh, Mohammedan oriented of casteism differentiated. Yeah. So how we can compare these two uh, things because this is Hinduism, this is Muslim compared to Mohammedan. How you compare it to both are equal? See, actually, when you read Quran, Quran is just a reminder of previous book, of previous book, which is what is the name of the previous book? previous book, like Bible, Torah, Injil, and uh, and a book of a uh, Sanatan Dharam. So, uh, Bible is the uh, front runner of Quran. Yeah, yeah, it's a reminder. That's it's reminding whatever the Quran is actually Furqan. Furqan means judge, uh, uh, separating, uh, correcting previous book. This is the purpose of Quran. Okay. And uh, Prophet Muhammad completed. Hmm. Islam in 7th century, the Islam we started first, first is Adam hmm. and from Adam uh, if you, f f and first is Tamil also hmm. and if you do the first research, like Tamil is the first language, Tamil uh, uh, first human being is black and Quran chapter 15 verse 26 says the same, the uh, first human being is black, then uh, Tamil is the first language, if you do the research you will come to know, then uh, cradle of civilization is Tamil Nadu, Sri Lanka, Kumari Khandab. Okay. Okay, sir. You're talking about too many information. Yeah. Let me confirm one by one, uh, because uh, you're talking about Islam and as well talking about Quran. And first, you registered that uh, Bible is front runner and Quran. Uh, Bible is front runner of uh, Quran. So first book is Bible, and and subsequently, and Quran has been taken place. And, uh, See, oh, and Prophet Muhammad. Prophet Muhammad is the last and final messenger. Yes, agree. Last, that. last and, and final uh, and. Uh, Quran doesn't uh, cancel the previous book. It rectifies the previous book. Uh, it's rectified or ratified, sir? Rectified. Matlab, whatever the interpolation is done by previous in previous book, uh. like uh, like for example, uh, if you read uh, uh, because the first is Tamil, and if you read Shivite system, the hmm. Koel system, Koel means house of elected minister. The same thing is applied in Quran also. Jumma system. Jumma is behind the elected minister. A get together behind the common people. Then we have a yoga and meditation. Same thing as a Sabar and Salat. Quran talks about Kundalini Chakra, mm. activation of Kundalini Chakra. Same thing as a Shiva system only. Mm. So you're comparing the, the Hindu... Uh, not Hindu. Hindu uh, is not the right term. 
Okay. Hindu is not the right term because uh, with so called as if now with so called the people can remember Shiva and uh, yeah uh, Shiva Shiva and uh, what was Tirumal and all these people is considered so, Hinduism. See Quran, Quran In, chapter cha, Quran chapter forty two verse thirteen yes. clearly says that Prophet Muhammad followed the religion of Noah. What what religion did Noah school of thought follow? And and they followed Abraham, Ismail, Isaac, all followed the same religion. Okay, sir, to understand very clear understanding for the viewers. Noah, it is discussing in the Bible. Quran, it is for Mughamadan. So-called understanding is Mughamadan, and you are talking about Shiva. Shiva, it is so-called understanding in Hinduism. So three kind of uh, the ism we are talking about, but you are connecting into one bowl because uh, Quran, it is the rectification of the book for the Bible. Previous book. Previous book for the that is called the Bible. Bible and plus uh, the books that came between Adam and Noah. Okay, so Noah, it is discussing in the Bible. So Adam and Noah, that is one one part, part and a uh, family of Abraham is, uh, is the second part. Okay. And uh, and if you read by Bible, from okay. after Noah we had three more race: Ham, Sham, and Japheth. Okay. From Semitic race we have Abraham. Okay. From Sham we have the Abraham race. So as per your concern, and for Adam and Noah, which textbook is talking about, sir? It's talking about uh, the books which uh, Tamils have. Uh, Vedas, everything. Vedas, oh. Puranas, Itihasas. Uh, lots of information of Tamils has has been uh, taken over by the Aryan settlers, and they have uh, interpolated the uh, lots of uh, been matters has been suppressed. Okay. Okay. Because see, Quran is not for Muslim. Okay. Islam started. Islam is a is a Islam, Quran is a uh, remi remi reminder for the Asivigam, Siddha way of life, and first Siddha is Shiva. And as per Quran chapter ninety six one to five, Adam Allah thought by pen. Okay. So if you if you ask any Tamil people who is the first Siddha, who is the first master, he will say Tamil. So as Siva. per your con, as per your research, Quran is Siddha system. So it's Asivagam, yeah. It's a, it's a reminder for Asivagam system. Okay. Is the first Siddha is called Shiva, Shiva Lord Shiva, Shiva. Shiva. Okay. So that the concept will be derived in Asivagam. Yeah, Asivagam. In Asivagam, later on it will be called as a Quran. Yeah, it's a it's a reminder for Asivaga. Okay. It's a book. It's a last and final book. It's okay. not a. It's a. It's, it's, that book doesn't complete the law. It is completes few few rules and regulation has been changed. For example, like previously there was intercaste marriage was not allowed. Intercaste marriage, but in now Asivaga. in Asivaga. In Asivaga. Now okay. that uh, Quran has rectified that old law, okay. and uh, now intercaste marriage is allowed. So in Quran, intercaste marriage, marriage is allowed. allowed. It, it has changed the law. Correct. Caste is profession. Profession. Yeah. All right, all right. So you yeah, ask for the Quran. Caste means profession. Profession. Profession is allowed. Inter inter caste for marriage is allowed. You can marry your slave, like a labor class. You can marry you. In in the world, the very major people following Jesus Christ and as well Christianity will be following it. And regardless of the countries and regardless of the race and sex of the people, they believe that the first person in the world is Adam and Eve. True. So Adam and Eve, you are talking that. Tamil is the uh, the first language, as per your research, you you told me that Tamil is the first language. Adam and Eve, what what is the language of Adam and Eve? So, so as per your research, it's Tamil only. It's Tamil. It's Tamil, only. Tamil. Because see, today first human color okay. color is black, and Quran chapter fifteen verse twenty twenty six says that first human being is black. Total Bible also uh, refers the same. Mm -hmm. So first human is black. First language is we do research. Tamil is the first language. Cradle of civilization is Tamil Nadu, Sri Lanka, Kumari Kandal. This is where the civilization started. So uh, I do have one question, sir. So being a Muslim and you believe that Tamil is the first language. Yeah. And you confirming that Adam and Eve language is the Tamil. Yeah. And even God's language is Tamil. God's language is Tamil. Tamil, yeah. So how do you have come to conclusion that God's language is Tamil? See, if if you do, if you because the Quran is a reminder for previous. Book, scriptures and uh, revelation and okay. previous scriptures uh, are with tamil people and if you ask any tamil they will uh, because the first generation of adam are tamil only na so they have the information and quran is a reminder for them so uh, as per your concept so quran is the reminder for the previous book that is hasivagam hasivagam and so, hasivagam uh, written uh, in tamil tamil yeah so why the quran is written in arabic because the prophet is in uh, arabic clan na Okay, and plus the Quran also because because Bible is is kind of Quran also contains information of Bible also Torah and Injil also, but that language is not Arabic. So all the information uh, of uh, previous book, Asivagam uh, books and uh, 
Torah and Injil is coming to Prophet Muhammad because Prophet Muhammad is an Arabic prophet, uh, Arab prophet. His language is uh, Arabic, so his all the information is given in Arabic language. So how the transformation has been taken place? Because in Tamil to Arabic, how the transformation? Because and still Tamil is in alive in the world. So since it is very uh, because all other languages are have been uh, uh, formatted. All other languages are formatted. Only the Tamil has been given by the God. So still Tamil is alive. So as per your concept, Quran is the the uh, right, reminder right. book of the Asivagam. Asivagam still it is in Tamil. And why it has been transformed into Arabic? Because the Prophet is in Arabic, the Arab land. Agreed, sir. Prophet yeah. is in Arab. Why it is gone gone into Arab? Well, this is a continuation. See, if you read uh, the, the, the Tamil history, Tamil history is divided into four parts. Okay. First part is Adam. Okay. Adam. Adam uh, is black. First human being is black as per science, as per Quran, as per Bible. Okay. Where Adam lives in, in the world, sir? Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. So you are very uh, yeah, you're confirmed. Hundred percent uh, confirmed. There is a Adam Peak and Adam Bridge uh, over there. In so Sri Adam Lanka. race and Adam genes and Adam DNA has been find it in the uh, yeah Sri in, Lanka. Yeah. So the first person who have been generated in the Sri Lanka. So which means Sri Lanka it is Tamilian land. Yeah, Tamilian land. It's so a Tamilian as land. As per the historical. It's historical. Tamil Sri Lanka, Tamil Nadu, Kumari Khanda. This is the first part uh, of the story. And the, actually, if you see, Cain was the first uh, child of Adam. For Adam. For, for Adam. Okay. He and he was not the color of Adam. He was a different color. He was an Aryan race, white color. So, how come possible, sir? Because he is a son of Adam, so That's obviously a, son can resemble the yeah. father. So you, you have to do uh, uh, race history. If you see the world by race, Quran uh, gives us the direction. See ah. by uh, color and language. So we have uh, different different people on earth. We cannot see the faith. If you say I am a good person, how can I uh, trust you? But by race, I can say he's a uh, he's from which race? Chinese have a different uh, DNA. Africans have the different DNA. Semitics have the different DNA. Europeans have the different DNA, and hmm. Tamils have the different DNA. So hmm. we have five races uh, altogether. And first is Tamil DNA. Second is uh, Aryan DNA. Hmm. Hmm. So the story rotates around uh, uh, Tamil and Aryan. Okay. As per your concept, has been the first is Tamil uh, DNA. First. Yes. And second DNA is Aryan. Aryan DNA. And the these two. The first part. Okay. The first two. The, the, these two parts has been mainly you have taken. Yeah, taken part. Okay. Uh, Tamilian, as per the evidence, is just saying that. Uh, Adam is the the first person of Tamilian, Tamilian DNA. DNA. So that has been located in Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. The entire land is belongs to Tamilian. Tam Tamilian. So nobody cannot claim those land into for any See, other persons. The people who are speaking Singhalese language over there, yes. by DNA they are Tamil. We are fighting on the basis of language, which was divided by the foreigners. We to do, to take the land and the resources of this uh, land of Tamil. All right. They people are dividing the people as per the language. Okay. See, by race, uh, those people are Tamilian. Okay. They may be speaking any language. Today, people are speaking uh, Dravidian language, but by race, they are Tamilian. Na? Because nowadays, the people are scientifically advanced. The people asking for evidence. Why? Because as per your concept, research, and all that, you're saying that I'm by race and by DNA, I'm a Tamilian. Because since they, I'm a Sri Lankan, and uh, by race, I'm a Tamilian. What is the proof for it? See, proof. Uh, Bible and Quran. If, if you believe in Bible and Quran, okay, then you will we will come to know because it's it's a guideline, a history book for a particular race, Christian, Protestants, Roman Catholic, Shia, Sufi, Wahhabi have no connection to holy books. Okay, but we are connecting a particularly a race of people and Tamilians. The land is called Sri Lanka because in we have a, a lot of uh, evidences called some Tamilian land is Sri Lanka. Mm -hmm. But Sri Lankan DNA also is a Tamil, Tamil alone. Tamil alone. As per your uh, research concern, how do you come to a conclusion that Sri Lankan DNA also can Tamilian? See, see th those people who migrated there after the war of Kalinga, they migrated. Six, six, seven to eight hundred people they migrated from Orissa to during uh, Ashoka time after the Kalinga war. Okay. So, uh, because see, they are migrated from Tamilian land. Yeah, they have migrated from Tamil. the forefathers of Tamilians. Tamilians, because see, that's why I say we have to divide uh, Tamil history into four parts. The first part is uh, all the pyramids huh? across the globe huh? are built by the Tam Tamilians. Pyramids. Pyramids. Yes. Okay. Pyramids. They are built by uh, Tamilians. Okay. 
so the pramit concept is not for egyptians egyptian is also a part of tamil land previously before the flood okay before the flood has been taken yeah. place from uh, land into uh, uh, water and water no no ha no ha no ha period before the time the noha flood uh, the history before the noha flood belongs totally to tamil people okay then after uh, flood we have three more race ham sham and jafar from ham we have the african blacks sham we have the semitic blacks uh, which we call of ibrahim family from jafar we have the chinese mongolian okay all together there are five race okay so as per uh, as per in tamil reference i came to know for the three name what you have told and up to nova uh, nova period from adam to nova so the people used to speak only tamil, tamil language. language so no other language no has not been spoken no, after no. which so okay. after the nova there is a three race will be uh, they will yeah. been coming to but existence. during the during the time of uh, noha we had two race one is aryan and another is uh, tamil okay so aryans so, are sanskrit language sanskrit is just a oral language oral oral not a written form no there is no any written format for no, no. as like and tamil no, people got language. into written form just uh, maybe in vedic age 4000 years bc on that time so aryan languages yeah so from uh, so as per your research you make it as a two two adam to nova two we have a two race two race tamil and aryan tamil and aryan. after nova to as of still till date we have a three races yeah So, so that is same kam yabet and that is uh, that we call it in Bible mm-hmm. and you do you you call it in Shem Ham Sham Jafar Ham Sham Jafar Jafar yeah all right um, after Nova how uh, the Tamil land, uh, land or uh, the concept of uh, 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 the Sanatana Kolgai uh, the principle of Sanatana so how it has been uh, built up see. we have the coil system okay. we have to go by the principle like uh, first we have to understand that uh, first murder took place first murder first murder yes yeah. in the world in the world by okay. the first son of adam that is cain okay okay no. so cain is the father of aryan race he was cursed and banished from cradle of civilization that is tamil nadu okay the first murder uh, that is the the, the victim is abel ah. and uh, the murder is cain Yeah. So Cain, the reign, uh, race has been started as uh, the first murder. He was cursed and banished from cradle of civilization, and that's why till today, Aryan concept has not not entered into Tamil Nadu because okay. of the curse uh, of Cain. Okay. Okay. So we have to understand this. There are two races. One is Aryan race, another is Tamil race. Tamil is a highly civilized race, okay. and uh, uh, Aryans are a hunter gatherer society, cave people. Okay, okay. Two race. Okay. And Prophet Noah is a prophet for his people, like Tamil nation. That's why Kumari Khandam is uh, Bible. These people have interpolated the, the Bible that it's a global flood, but it's not a global. It's a local flood. It's only for the Tamil people. And Kumari Khandam submerged. And after Kumari Khandam submerged, we had three more race. But how, why Kumari Khandam submerged? Because as per the Bible, if you read the Bible, they are they were mixing DNA. Like, but but before that, we have to understand Shiva. What is Shiva? Mm-hmm. Okay. 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 Shiva is the first Siddha. All the information which uh, God has given is, on all subject is to Shiva. All right. So when Shiva is coming to an existence, he is the third son of Adam. The s- biblical name for Shiva is Set. Uh, whether the Shiva has been appeared uh, Adam and Nova period or after the Nova he period, he is the third son. Third son of third, Adam. Third son. Third son. So, so in, in between, first the... son is Cain. Hmm. Second is Abel. Third is Set. Set is biblical. Set is Shiva. and islam an uh, islamic term is shish al islam shish shish yeah okay so shiva is son of uh, adam. adam okay so and he is the first what is the that? proof for it sir see nine quran is as i told you earlier quran is a reminder of previous book yes quran talks about uh, teaching someone with pen okay and as per the uh, tamil uh, inform tamil uh, tradition okay. the first person who who was thought was the siddha of uh, on the various subject is shiva Mm. and quran also chapter 3 verse 30 talks about the uh, succession uh, administration mm. and shiva de- uh, genealogy succession like mm. set if you see set as you read bible set a royal uh, bloodline of set it goes up to uh, noha and after that it goes up to uh, uh, ravana Ra- ravan so noha it is goes up to ravana after noha it goes up to ravana okay after noha uh, period it is uh, first adam to noha and noha to ravana ravana Chapter three, verse thirty-three. Chapter three, verse thirty-three of Quran. Adam, Noah, family of Abraham, family of Abraham. 
All right. So that that is the, uh, the that is a reference is available in Quran. Yeah, Quran is there. So chapter three and verse thirty three, it's discussing about Adam, Noah, family of Imran, family of Ibrahim. All right. Okay. Fine. So and, uh, you are making into uh, the two parts. That two is parts. Adam to Noah, Noah to Ravana. So up to which there is Tamil race. Tamil race. So and from uh, uh, previously uh, during the time of uh, Shiva up to Noah, the f almost full earth was uh, under the occupation of Tamil people. Okay. And after the flood, from Turkey to Indus Valley, Indus Valley to Bangladesh, Sri Lanka, and Southeast Asian country, Cambodia, all this Thailand, these people, this land was uh, Tamil land. So all this, uh, you're talking about for two continental area, it is, uh, it is belongs to Tamil. Area. Yeah, earlier wherever you find uh, pyramids, it oh. is built by Tamil race. From each concept is Tamil race. Tamil Tamil race. There's no alien or something. It's a uh, no Anunnaki, no alien. They are all built by Tamil people. It's not hail in the Tamilian. Yeah, it's Tamilian. Okay. Uh -huh. So maybe they, they take out the T yeah. and they call it as an alien. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Fine. So uh, uh, sh I, I, I do have certain question on Shiva. Uh, Shiva, the characteristics it described so far we understanding is Shiva having uh, the tiger uh, uh, skin, the tiger skinned person. And as well, the job of the Shiva is to kill the people. He is also a preserver, na? As, as well as a destructor. Yes, he is a destroyer. <laughs> he is a destroyer as well as a preserver. Na? As a preserver. Preserver. Na? He's, he, he's the job, main job is to preserve and as yes, well destroy. save and destroy. The two things, the, the work of Shiva. See, see but if, if you study Shiva, we, huh. we all are Shiva. Because the inform, Shiva is nothing but a, a, a book, a information. Huh. And that information, if you want, you can preserve the earth. If you With that information, if you want, you can destroy the earth. So... Um, we have to keep the balance. So as you told that uh, who and all is ready to save the human's life for any any any. The preserver uh, part of Shiva. life is part of Shiva. Part of Shiva. So you you are you are abiding with Kamala Hassan uh, statement. <laughs> so you also God and me also God like that. Everyone is God because what what is Atma? Atma is a it's it's a it's soul. A, it's a go, it's a soul and ah. it's a God's particle. Okay. Atma is nothing but God particle. Okay. That's why in uh, Shiva Shiva system we have to activate our Kundalini chakra uh -huh. to active and get connected to higher conscious. So you believe in Kundalini chakra. Kundalini chakra. Even Quran says na chapter 15 verse 87. Quran is talk about Kundalini, Kundalini chakra. So chapter. Yeah, uh, 15 verse 87. Oh, all right. And what it talks about about the Kundalini in Quran, sir? Because uh, after wisdom, see we cannot we if we read book. We keep ah. reading book and getting wisdom is two different things. Okay. So wisdom comes from a higher conscious. All right. So all the ancient siddhas, all the prophets, all the things are went into seclusion hmm. for doing meditation. Hmm. And meditation and yoga is a, is nothing but to activate ourselves to get in connected with higher conscious. And it's possible because we have the atma in us. And atma is, atma is nothing but God's particle. So, uh, uh, in, in Tamil, in, in ancient period in Tamil, we call it as Ogam. Ogam, it is a kind of a concept of uh, Shiva. It is introduced for the Yogam. And now it is called as a Yoga. And this concept is belongs to purely for Tamilians. Tamilians. So, it is not belongs to San, uh, the Aryan. Uh, Aryans, uh, they, they were cursed and banished. Because no prophet came in among them. They, are no, they, they had no prophets. So, they are cursed with people. They are, they, they are, they are separated. They are, they are not uh, civilized people. Okay. They're till today they are not so civilized. All right. Yes, agree that. So the the, the completely see the story the by story God. of the earth rotates around Tamil people. Okay. Even see if you look look at uh, Columbus, he wanted to come to India. Okay. To meet whom? Tamil Tamil civilization. Tamil civilization. Tamil people, yeah. To get the uh, technology which they had to trade with them. But Columbus concept is not to visit Tamil people because he visit to the people of uh, civilization. Yeah. So the the place that he visit. It is called as India. It's India. So but it is so the, the technology is with the whole whole black people in India are Tamil, na? Not only the part of Tamil Nadu, but full India, Pakistan, wherever the black people are there, they are Tamilians by race. So as per your concept, who and all black people in in the world, they are not not not, not world. Uh. There are three types of black. Uh. First black is Tamil. Uh. Second black is uh, African blacks. Okay. Third is Semitic black. Semitic. Semitic. Like that's uh, where from uh, children of Israel have come. And uh, Obama and all the, uh, the South uh, the yes. American, American black are uh, uh, Semitic black. 
semantic blanks yeah so the semantic blanks and uh, necros and all that the people is not comes in tamil race no they are actually uh, aryans and tamils are cousin and uh, ham sham and jafet are children of uh, tamil race that's why uh, asivagam concept is we can find shiva in among the tamil civilization chinese civilization also they they have that uh, kundalini uh-huh. activation uh, system is there similarly same with applies with the uh, semantic as well as uh, okay uh, hermetic and right from the beginning of the world and up to veda in tamil concept there is two two types of concept and for aryan they, they don't have any written written concept concept only for tamilians they do have a written concept the written concept will be of uh, starting with uh, um, uh, adam and adam to noah oh. and now it has been asiga asivagam concept the same asivagam concept it has been followed by the quran yeah followed by a family of ibrahim where all the prophets uh, came and uh, from prophet of uh, from family of ibrahim we have prophet muhammad so if the same uh, pattern has been followed by the quran and do you think that iran iraq and all other majority in the muslims countries and what were following the quran concept they are all tamilians or different other races they are actually settlers settlers because I, as i told you na from uh, turkey to indus valley belongs to tamil nation but after the invasion of aryans and uh, persian empire and roman empire hmm. those land was occupied by settlers hmm. and settlers are hiding behind the muslim label shia sufi wahhabi all this because see seven, in the uh, 7th century hmm. islam got completed quran got completed islam got completed the islam we started from shiva hmm. Hmm. In century, the, this islam which the quran talks about is the fir- is talking about the first siddha islam okay the first siddha is shiva and whatever the information which uh, god gave to shiva mm. that rules and regulation minor changes has been taken place in uh, quran like for, for example in the old testament only 10 commandments were given to children of israel okay okay, okay. okay. so okay. like every period based on their capacity god judge whether this this community will take up the law or not okay so she, the quran is basically just a changing of rules little a slight change in laws no. quran is a continuation it's it's, it's, a, it's connected with the first adam noah family of imran family of ibrahim okay okay and the first is tamil and first siddha is uh, shiva so shiva whatever the shiva got the rules and regulation is been followed by the uh, uh, completed uh, that rules and regulation now no new rules will come okay okay it's completed okay so as per your concept is uh, in 7th century uh, islam got completed complete. the rules and regulation for the whatever period. the uh, abrogation or any deletion or addition is there it has been completed so the regulations its concept is uh, in terms of uh, how to lead the life and so already the life is already been uh, show, given to uh, shiva ah. every rules and regulation of mode of worship everything is been uh, mode how to govern the people everything is with shiva the same thing is been uh, talked by prophet uh, quran and prophet muhammad Okay. the only few like for example i'll give you that uh, uh, like uh, inter caste marriage uh-huh. in uh, in asiragam it was not allowed okay. but uh, this after this uh, quran has allowed the inter inter you can marry your slave like uh, lower caste even the labor class people you can marry the elites can marry the labor okay. class so the complete shape of the governing the people and give birth and all that uh, the people morality and the principle of the live the life and all that will been completed in the 7th century hmm? in terms no, of no 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 it's the rules and regulation is already there with uh, shiva ah. shiva is there but only few rules and ru- regulation are amended change ah, little bit i agree yeah, i agree yeah, yeah, yeah. i agree because already the rules and regulations given by the god to shiva yeah to shiva to uh, shiva is the, the ultimate yeah. the ultimate person who have been narrated the all the rules and regulations yeah. the the narrated regular the written the document system everything but whatever yeah. yes. how to the, live the life written... but the mode of worship is still the same yoga okay. meditation kundalini chakra and uh, standing behind the elected minister that no, is completely a... remain be the same. same 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 so there has been derived from the god to shiva, shiva so and... shiva has been written the document yeah. that is called the asivagam asivagam so that asivagam completed in the 7th century, century. there is after the 7th century the few amendments taken place in the 8th century that is no, no 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 not 8th century 7th ah. century last 7th century full last. stop no 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 amendment 8th century actually we are the people who uh, who change the ru- rules and regulation are the not from the tamil race they mm. are from aryan settlers okay like how jesus said mm. jesus said in the bible that uh, you cannot uh, cancel the old law we have to follow the old law yes. but saint paul says that you don't have to follow the law mm. who is saint paul saint paul is a greek aryan yes similarly uh, after and uh, this, uh, this uh, saint paul never saw jesus christ 
Mm. He cannot be an apostle mm. because apostle means one who is with uh, Jesus Christ. Mm. So he he is he is having a put himself as a uh, own apostle. He has claimed he is apostle, but he, as per technical term, he is not an apostle. Yes. Similarly, same thing happened with Prophet Muhammad after the completion of Quran, Asivagam. Then the Aryan settlers, Roman and Persian, they started uh, interpolating the corrupting the system because they want the Varna Dharam caste system to be maintained and Asivagam is not uh, based on caste system untouchability it's, it's uh, like people were living in golden age before prior to untouchable era they were living in golden age what was the system because the system at that time was that common people took an active part in administration so ruling and the common people were equal good okay the so same thing applies with uh, prophet muhammad also said the, the same thing what is jumma friday prayer Friday prayer is behind the Khalifa, appointed minister. Yes. What we are doing? We are standing behind Pujari, okay. Brahmin system. Yes. So nothing is there. It's just ritual is happening over there. Okay. But the ultimate goal is to bring peace among the society. This is what the meaning of Islam means. Correct. Peace. Peace between the society. Um, we are living together. With peace between the animal kingdom, plant kingdom, uh, space, air kingdom, animal birds. We have to live in harmony with everyone. All right. So the eighth century. Shia, Shia Aryans, Persian Aryans, they started Shia concept, 8th sure. century. Okay. 9th century, Sunni concept came about. Okay. 13th century, Sufism came about. 18th century, Wahhabi came about. Wahhabi, Wahhabis are Saudi. Saudis are not uh, real Arabs. Real Arabs are black. Those are Aryan settlers. Okay. Okay. So, so the, uh, it means the fight is between the cousin, between two, two cousin system. One is Shiva, uh, Tamil and uh, Aryans are cousin brothers. Okay. You can rectify Europe. Europe, after the First World War, Second World War, they entered into spiritualism and they rectified themselves. But since Aryan settlers, the coming of Antichrist, which the Bible talks about, mm. and the Hadith talks about the uh, coming of uh, Dajjal, the Kalyuga, the Kalyuga was started by the Aryan settlers. Okay. So, so we are fighting with the two cousins are fighting over the system. Okay. So they are basically corrupting the uh, official, corrupting the people, corrupting, maintaining the Brahminism system. Okay. See so today Arya Varta, today what is happening in India, like today Arya in India and in, in minority. Arya Varta concept is not possible in India. Okay. But still that funding is coming from Saudi and Muslim world because by DNA they are what Roman Empire, Persian Empire. Quran chapter 49 verse 13 clearly says to identify by race and tribe. Okay. Not by religion. Okay. Faith is something personal to you. Okay. What you are, your, is, I cannot see. Yes. But by race, I can see whether he is Chinese, whether he is African or Semitic or European or uh, Aryan or uh, Tamil. So we have to identify as per tribe. This is this is what Quran uh, says. We have to identify by race. So based on race history, I went into Tamil race history, Mongolian race history. This different different history. What is what 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 was the, what is the history of your, uh, Europe? They, they say they are living in dark ages, gay, lesbian, uh, animal sex, uh, ch ch uh, all the uh, anti-spiritual they are following. But after first world war, second world war, they were rectified. But after the uh, in contact with Wahhabism, again they uh, went into dark ages. They are struggling. Okay. See today they have we have the single yes. currency in yes. Europe. Yes. So people are not running after money. Yes. There is peace in uh, society. Mm. Mafia is gone. Mm. But today, uh, like, ultimately, see, today in India, we are living in the state of confusion. Mm. There is no proper, like, we, uh, all the Dalit movement, Periyar movement, every, every the Dravidian movement has failed. Mm. And ultimately, Brahmins are still in power. How is mm. it possible? Okay. They have come in power. Okay. So, this until unless we don't go back to the Shivayat system, the coil system and uh, common people going into re going into coil and fighting for their rights, then only equality will come. Na? So, Quran also amended in the Tamil language or in Arabic language? No, Arabic language. Arabic language. Why it has been changed, sir? See, Arabic language, why? Because the prophet is from Arab. And Quran not only talks about Tamil, it talks about Ibrahim also. The Quran... Say, statement is there in Quran saying that the prophet is in Arabia. His language is Arabic. He will, uh, we will give him a revelation in Arabic. He will understand and then he will guide you. Okay. So, as per your concept that uh, in 7th century, Muhammad Nabi is the prophet. Is the prophet. 
so he's is lived in 7th century from uh, 630 was i think 632 was the last okay yeah so that is the last yeah so but also though it is written in the arabic it is followed of the continuation Tamil. chapter, chapter is, 42 verse 13 it is continuation yeah. of lord shiva masi work yeah, concept yeah, yeah. because uh, uh, chapter 42 was 13 clearly says the religion the school of thought which prophet muhammad followed was uh, what noha followed and noha is from the genealogy of shiva okay. set okay. as per biblical okay and whatever asivagam knowledge is carried is continuation and the same religion has been followed by ibrahim ismail isaac yakub is written in the chapter 42 verse 13 so uh, bible and quran and lord shiva they are one and the same one same they have everything no. concept is god same. is one na god is one god is one and okay. his his books are all one from okay. one source it's a continuation okay in the in the continuation of dynasty and one person aryan it is the cursed people yeah. they are not civilized so yes, far yes, yes, yes. so they wanted to be civilized once again so they are building the concept of sana so so, uh, so far they are building the concept of sana so that dividing the people of varnasaram dharmam yeah. and for that they dividing people into Uh, the sudras and the shias and all that the, all the concept will be come into as, uh, after which yeah, because can, the in, concept is building only for the concept of civilization of aryans yeah. no actually they they wanted to take over like shiva basically when a two, when a one race occupies another race it's quite natural that the uh, learned administer corporate will be in their hand and the, yes. and the native will become uh, shudra or labor untouchable yes so the indian uh, population were following the siddha asivagam system koil system where okay. they were actively taking part in administration yes after the uh, coming of aryans they were their rights were taken away so they were not allowed to enter into koil koil means parliament house house of a elected minister okay and then later they made it into an idol worship avatar system okay so there are two different uh, principle one is a uh, creation and a uh, balance and other is evolution aryan setra talks about evolution theory the avatara and all this are evolution theory and mythology yes okay so we we, we and shiva is fact and the my uh, this uh, vaishnava uh, uh, varna dharma and all this uh, kali this uh, is all a mythology okay. until today they are not ready to accept tamil as a civilized society but yeah. as per the historical uh, the, the the research is concerned tamil is the the first thing the only civilized only race on earth it is civilized uh, civilized uh, yeah. the, the cultivation yeah and they attribute to alien anunnaki and all those uh, okay even for the primate concept also tamil tamil, tamil. there was no other, no other race only na so, from a single male and female bible bible says that and uh, quran Adam also as in any from that only the genealogy spread okay so the story divide is into three part uh, uh, Cain, Abel, Set, Set is Shiva. Okay. And rest is all the followers of Shiva. So in the world, and no other race has been there. And the first race has been initiated by the God as yeah. Tamil race. Tamil race. So now, after the Tamil race, and because of the first murder taken place by the Cain. Yeah. Uh, so the race has been divided into two. Tamilian and Arya. 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 So the cursed race, the people is called the the comes in by Aryan Aryan Arya, people. Cain, children of Cain. Children of Cain. Actually, the word Aryan is means noble. Okay. That word is uh, also been hijacked by them. Okay. Okay. <laughs> that you no know, that Aryan label should have been given to uh, Tamil people. <laughs> okay. 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 <laughs> But they are they tell them that they are Shudra, untouchable, Harijan. All these uh, various labels. So they don't. They don't have any concept of civilization. Yeah. They don't have a concept of administration skills. No. And they have built the uh, the civilization concept. So that is called Varna Sir Dharma. Yeah. Varna Ashram. Varna is there. Four profession is already there. Without profession, you cannot live. But the rights of administration is taken away from the labor class, na? Yes. They are not allowed to enter into coal. So if you want to see, we cannot we cannot end the profession. We need a learned administrator, corporate and labor. This is the system. Yes, this is. We cannot change the system. Yes, but uh, we can make we can bring equality between the ruling class and the labor class. How to coil system? We uh, 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 ruling and uh, common people should take an active part in administration. Okay. So the 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 term the coil that you pronounce the 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 term is uh, house of uh, electric uh, minister. King. Okay. Procedure to electing the the king of kingdom. Kingdom, yeah. So in earlier it was in coil. The, the, the term is called coil. Co- coil. Parliament. Par- Now it is called a temple. Yeah. It's not. They have made into uh, uh, avatar temple. Okay. Avatar is not a concept of Shiva. Okay. 
So they have completely they have changed yeah. into uh, the simple the temple is only for the for the purpose of worship. Worship, yeah. But initial stage is the purpose of electing the kingdom. Kingdom. And plus, I uh, see when God is within us, the Atma is within us. We have to just activate it and uh, connect to higher conscious. For that, you don't need uh, any temple. It's, it's your personal. Uh, you can sit in any corner of the of your house and do it. Okay, in Bible also in saying that, and uh, since you are uh, you are you are, you are the uh, temple, you are the church. Yeah. So that is the same Bible simple. So all the all the concept will be uh, will be uh, abiding with the Bible and as well Quran as well the Asi Bhagavan yeah, concept. concept yeah. So uh, now uh, all the Christians, all the Christian dynasty, all the Mahmudian and all other uh, the Veera, Vainavam, Shan, Shaivam and all the people in Tamilian hmm. will be of Tamil race. Tamil race. No, if, yeah, they will be of Tamil race and they have to follow Shiva because because if you don't follow Shiva Koel system, hmm. there will be no peace. The ruling and opposition will loot uh, the whole India and our whole world. So, though yeah. they are the Muslim, they have to follow Shiva concept. Yeah, they have to because Quran is talking. Na. If they are Muslim, then they should follow Quran. Okay. They are not following Jumma system. Na. Okay. Jumma is supposed to be behind elected minister. Okay. Kingdom, uh, they are following. Uh, there is no election system over there. Okay. There is no uh, Khalifa system over there. They are just following, uh, blind following their uh, Pujari, Ulamas. Okay. And they are giving uh, vague fatwas. How come the Muslims are accepted and as if now because they are very rigid in their uh, uh, following system of um, Mahmudan laws and all that? See, if you go back in the Bible, oh. the Gentiles are settlers. Je Jesus Christ clearly says in the Bible, I have come only for the lordship of house of, of Israel, not for Gentile. Gentiles yes. are the Aryan settlers. Okay. And Bible calls them uh, children of swine. Okay. Okay. And same thing uh, when Quran, uh, Quran chapter 36, 1 to 5. The comforter is nothing but Prophet Muhammad. Yes. And the last uh, Prophet when he came, the Quran chapter 36, 1 to 11 clearly says that mm. you have been sent to a people whose forefathers were not uh, warned. They had no warner. So they are heedless. If you warn them or you do not warn them, they will not believe. They are stiff-necked. Aryan and Mongolian. Yeah. Uh, the two rays are the... No, Aryan settlers, not uh, the, those people. Aryan settlers. Settlers. Okay, Aryan settlers that you mean to that uh, who have been cursed people. The, the race is cursed. If you ah. see karma concept and DNA concept, they are cursed. But the coming of Antichrist, coming of Antichrist refers to Roman Empire, Persian Empire, who are now hiding behind the Muslim label. So, Roman? Roman Empire and Persian Empire. Because oh. Jerusalem ah. is a city of uh, which race? Semitic black, Semitic Negros. Semitic black, yes. Semitic black. Yes. It has been uh, uh, when Jesus said, I have come only for the lordship of house of, house of Israel. Oh. Because of Roman Empire, Persian Empire, those uh, children of Israel, they migrated to Arab and uh, Africa. Mm. They migrated. Jesus Christ's mission is incomplete. Mm. And chapter 17, verse 104, mm. clearly says that end of time, before that is when the Jesus comes, he is going to bring back the children of Israel back to the, uh, and take his old Qibla, old administration center Jerusalem and the new Qibla that is Makkah, mm. uh, the, the administration center of Bani Israel, children of Israel to them. So now the Mecca is for? Uh, it's for Bani Israel only but it has been illegally occupied by the Saudis, Aryans. Aryans. Now, uh, what is the purpose of Mecca sir? Mecca is a get together of a tribal, uh, tribals, like I said it's a tribal uh, get together of Semitic blacks. Okay, so in earlier Mecca was Israel. No, uh, see the Koel system, administration center, because see, the, uh, from Turkey to Indus Valley belongs to Tamilian. But after the defeat of uh, Pandian kingdom, hmm. the uh, first king among the Bani Israel was Saul. As per the Bible and Quran, the first king uh, of among the Bani Israel was Saul. And then David came, killed Goliath, and Suleiman uh, built the uh, first temple of uh, first uh, temple of Suleiman. Okay. Because administration, the right. Okay. Is with uh, Tamil uh, Shiva uh, genealogy, Sh Sage genealogy. Okay. And, after and so the, far, Aryans are trying to defeat the Tamilian yeah. civilization. Si Tamil they as well as implement their they are, civilization. Yeah. Aryavarta concept is what? Okay. Aryavarta means uh, complete domination of uh, Aryan rules on uh, Tamil land. Tamil. But since uh, Tamil Nadu is a part of cradle of civilization, mm. and from this land, Cain was cursed and banished. And because of that uh, curse and banish uh, of God, they are not uh, getting entry in Tamil Nadu. Something is happening that they are being stopped. The only thing for them is that uh, they, they are afraid of is Tamil Nadu. Okay. Because this is the cradle of civilization. This is Jalikati. All of a sudden, uh, people have come. It's a Shivite concept, na? 
because uh, the because so DNA, DNA because they are and plus a uh, three corner mala is the real Kalash LTT uh, they, they fought for that uh, three corner mala you know? uh. the purpose behind LTT war was for three corner mala okay so that three corner is the real, the, the real Kalash of Shiva so the Kalash which has been located in, in Himalaya that is not actual that's Kailash. a fake that's a fake, fake because see like uh, how Jesus is, is black they painted him white okay Aryan are cave people. Okay. So they painted a Shiva as a cave people. So Shiva is completely black. He is a black man so and he is an administrator with a how administ administrator lives. He will yeah. live that way. Na? Okay. He is the first administrator of Tamilian yeah. and he was lives in Tamil land. Ha. So that is the uh, Kumari, Ka Kandam. Kumari Kandam. Kumari so Kandam and real Kailasha. Kailasha. Real Kailasha. So and that is the, uh, the, yeah. the, the, the living place of uh, Lord Shiva. Lord Shiva. The fake, that's uh, uh, Himalaya is a fake uh, Kailasha okay. because they have uh, portrayed uh, Shiva as uh, their own race. Okay, you're getting the point because see all the religion belongs to Aryans. Holy books belongs to black people. All right, all right, sir, and thank you so much for the uh, time you're spending with us and you're giving a lot number of uh, information um, uh, through your research and this is completely of new di uh, dimension that has been given to our people for understanding of the history and all that uh, because and uh, so far we are thinking that uh, uh, three kind of the major ism we are followed by the uh, across the global and uh, majorly uh, christianity and uh, hinduism and uh, muslim Muhammadan. And now uh, we come to the conclusion that uh, Mahmaran and Christianity both are brothers and sisters, yeah. and they are they they are been taken in one race, and uh, they'll been uh, they, they they do have a written document of set of principles. Yeah. The all principles that termly called as a Asivagam sure. by Lord Shiva. So after which it'll be so far it'll be the the revolution has been given to uh, Prophet Muhammad, and yeah. that has been written in Arabic language. Yeah. So that is an Asivagam concept again. Asivagam, reminding the Asivagam concept. Asivagam concept. The Quran clearly says it's a reminder. All right. It's not a book of conversion. Okay, it's a reminder. It's a reminder. All right. And people who don't have anything, like how, don't have any books of honor, how can it, the Quran be their reminder? So it is not talking. We're talking about for the ism. We're talking about the uh, DNA and race. Race only. So and language. Yeah. So that is the main thing that we have to follow. That is why we have to understand in future. Yeah. So identify by race and tribe. All right. Thank you so much. So thank you so much for giving in time and all that. Okay, thank you. And uh, this is when this is going to be a great. Uh, star and great uh, new type of uh, dimension of thinking of people and this is going to be uh, a very big uh, great success for your future and uh, as for the mercury so channel and we, we wish you a lot and lot of success and give me give us a lot more uh, uh, beautiful information our uh, history so for a Tamilians and we do have only for grammatical evidence we don't have any historical evidence and latestly we just come to know for clarity and all that and this information are all completely quite different and we can come to know that uh, how it has been uh, driven out and all that. See, it's in Kerala uh, civilization, there is no idol found. That's why the, in the first two years, I think, uh, center stopped the funding of uh, excavation. It was the state government who started the excavation because there was no evidence of uh, their Vedic age. Yes, yes. They stopped it. <clears throat> yes. So there's a... The men's, uh, it's like a step son. Uh, at, uh, center is just uh, considering uh, Tamil as a step son. All right. <laughs> so still they are they they're trying to establish their their own Aryan civilization. civilization. They suppress the Tamilian civilization. Tamil civilization. Okay, all the way because one day because truth will coming out of one day. So now you are taking care of it and, and thank you so much for the part of this show, sir. And I'm sure we're going to be on the next show. And thank you so much for that. Thank you.